You are welcome to another video of Juniper Security Associate course. In this section, I will have an overview of the Juniper SRX UTM feature. UTM or Unified Threat Management is a feature which integrates multiple security features into a single device. In Juniper SRX device, it includes antivirus, anti-spam, content filtering, and web filtering. UTM means the integration of multiple security services into a single device which may vary across vendors. In Juniper SOX device, it includes antivirus, anti-spam, content filtering, and web filtering. For antivirus, we have two options, local Avira antivirus and cloud-based Sophos antivirus. Local antivirus, of course, needs more CPU and memory resources. Anti-spam feature check incoming and outgoing emails to identify spam. Spam emails can be blocked or just tagged. It requires a third party database or local whitelist and blacklist to detect spam emails. By content filtering feature, you can control traffic based on file type, which is also called MIME type, file extension and protocol commands. By file type, it means as examples, JPEG file or MP4 file. By extension, it means it checks just the extension of the file regardless of the file type. For protocol commands, FTP delete command or HTTP post commands are some examples. By content filtering, you can also filter ActiveX and Java applets, which can be source of vulnerability, especially in web browsers. By web filtering feature, you can limit web access based on web categories. It can be implemented based on local web sense or cloud-based self-control server. Most of the UTM features require a license, but some features like content filtering and local web filtering or redirect-based web filtering don't need any license to work. This is a table taken from Juniper website shows which of UTM features require or don't require license work.